Yo, I can't even explain how embarrassed look people are. Look, people look like absolute idioso. They came for somebody that the shit that some people said about some of you guys. So imagine this. Imagine that somebody says, um, yo, this person, man, they're, they're, they're prostitute. They shoot up. They don't, they don't shower. And then all of a sudden people go around you and you're teaching them things that they never could have gotten from anywhere else. You're clean. You're beautiful. You're sober. You're intelligent. Some of you guys are gifted. You can paint. You can sing. You can draw. There's nothing you can't do. And just and you know what's even the worst is that sometimes some of these people were actually mothers and their grandmothers. Men. It's just people are starting to see like how deep envy goes, and that there's no age limit on the shit. Let's get down. Interpretation. Yeah, somebody's interpretation of you. Or someone you're connected to was so off. It's like 12 o'clock exactly. Let's just see. Show the people interpretation and spirit. You're bigger than this place. Yeah. Somebody's moonwalk. She did it true on one walk. One walk right there. Yeah, there's something here like you could also you could be exposing liars on social media. You could be that person. But let, let's see what's up with the spirit and the networker. This is also somebody that just, you know, spreads uh, a gossiper. They do this. It's, a, it's a, um, a smear campaign. They try to, like, dirty your spirit or something like that. Tell me about this networker. This networker, please. It's like every lunch. It's a hobby, but she's good at it. So what are you doing that you're really super good at that these people can't stand with the network? You got people in intentionally talking shit on you. I also see that like you share information and people are pissed off about that. So you're not the type of person where, or who I'm speaking to, you're the type of person where you figure something out that could help a lot of people. You share that. You're not the type of person that keeps it in. It's like, well, I'm just going to keep this for myself and let everybody else suffer or let everybody else have to deal with this. So... And you got people that are pissed off about that. People can also be pissed off about what you're putting on your social media too. But what this this is like you're helping people look at things differently. Like you're an awakened being with the hanged man. Like you look at something differently. This could be your platform here with the four of wands. You could have a platform where people are are, you know, you whatever news you're putting out, like people may be pissed off or there's a lot of competition, especially if this is YouTube. This is such competition, man. This is so much competition. Spirit, test the spirit on the shit that you're listening to, you guys. Tell me more about this, please. Social media app, yeah. So that's what this is. This is all about social media, uh, how you may be changing people's perspective. Like people are weighing out their options about what, what they think about this world. Like you help people. You also help people like balance their world. You bring balance to people. You help people that are like this be like this. And there's people that are pissed off about this shit or they're jealous or they're com there's so much competition. So much competitive energy on, on, on social media. I can't believe it. I, I never realized police, TikTok for sure. So you could have a TikTok. You could be even helping the police look at things different. That's the kind of presence that you have. Whatever this is that you're networking you're waking police up. You're helping. Listen, this is like bringing balance into a world that's, you know, I feel like some of these people were on the fence. And now these people also like around your home, I see that were like, I don't know, this could be like gang stalkers or people that wanted to get revenge. Now these people are like stuck watching you i feel like they're also seeing that the police there may be police officers that are actually taking someone's side now and that's worrying your opposition because the only reason these people kept doing this shit because you're exposing them whatever you're doing on your social media whatever this is that you network this is you exposing this is probably gang stalkers and stuff and i feel like now people are like well damn man, you got police officers that are now taking your side and they're worried now it's like well now these people are like oh 
there, 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 hold on, let me see here. What is this, please? Child passed away from spell work, all this shit going back to people. So I feel like these police know, like they, they know that people mess with spell work. They're probably witnessing people's children dying. TikTok. There could be a child, um, hold on, just went viral. So one of you guys may go viral. Something that you did is going to go viral or it already did. I do feel like this could be for somebody that has a TikTok. You're, you're seeing, going backwards, look at this shit, all this spell work. I got Pisces is the major here. I mean, I got the world, you know, the Taurus, Scorpio, Aquarius, Leo, right? Is that what that is? It's just not my speed. Tell me about this child passed away. Everyone. Everyone. What? Are, what's, what's with everyone? Everyone what? Everyone's looking at something differently? Police and everyone. No business even trying. So these people had no business even trying to come against you. Or doing whatever this five of swords shit. They had no business even trying it. Tell me about this everyone. They should be policing everyone. So maybe it's like, maybe people are realizing like, you're not supposed to be like, it's not just you just police who you want, but you're supposed to police, which would be what? What is the actual definition of police? Mm. A civil force responsible for the prevention and detection of crime and maintenance. So maybe this is just them saying, like, you're supposed to be fair with this. So maybe maybe this is something for, like, tell me about this child passed away. Tell me about this child passed away. Page of Swords could have been an air sign child. A young child. A page. A Pisces. Yeah, I got Pisces here twice. Mile. Police everyone mile. Damn, this sucks. I mean, I don't ever want to see a child. I, is it the pop? Is this? Is this? This isn't the child of a cop, is it? Come at me! Come at me! This is a child's. Uh, this is a police officer's child passed away. I feel like this just happened. There's a Pisces police officer. What is their name? What is their letter of the laughing stock? So this whoever this dirty cop is though. Wild. Their part their child could have been wild anyway. You could have spoken this. You could have put the page of swords. You could have said this. Like you keep messing with this shit. Something went back to a cop that was getting involved with this. What's the first initial? P. Pete. This could be that Peter. Punch? What? Wild and punch? Wild punch? Is it drinking? Yeah, it's like punch, like wow, punch, like uh, liquor. Give me the true spirit. It could have been like a DUI or an accident or something. PI, private investigator. There's a lot happening here. Silver car. They could have had a silver car or somebody could in this situation. Or their kid got punched. Should be put away foreclosure people so that's just how it's going back this is what they're saying this is how some of these things are going back and coming full circle now for these people who wanted you to be stuck these people who were coming against you while you were just speaking the truth on a social media page possibly these people who were lying on you too and saying like how you got your money they could have possibly been and telling people that you got money and how you how you made your money or something like that or even whoever you're in a relationship with they were just lying they were doing this you know what they do man 
Now the shit's going backwards and people's kids are passing away. Their houses are being foreclosed on. This jealous ass energy as well. What is this, man? Thank you. Mother didn't want you. So something happening with your mom. This shit makes me sick, man. I never realized just how uh, how bad jealousy is. I, I gotta ask, so I, I wanna know, did this did their son or I feel like it's a son? Is I command the truth. Is this child that passed away was it a son? I command the truth. Was it a son? No, it was a daughter. Command. Okay, I command the truth. Did they get can, did they get hit? No. Command the truth, spirit. Was it like overdosing or something? Or drinking and driving or <sighs> I got to dispose of the body. Oh, hold up. What? Power. Abuse of power. This police officer in particular, this could be happening to just this person, man. This one cop whose name begins with this could have been so fucked up, man, that let's just say it's not even spell work, right? But I'm guessing that they had something to do with the shit. This could literally be like their whole life is like exploding. Like nothing is going right for this person. If this was a police officer that was supposed to protect and serve and instead you only protected your child, their child passed away. I'm pretty sure with the page of swords, like I remember saying this about the about these people. I said if you're a police officer or anyone of authority, you suppose it figure and you are only protecting your children and not other people's children, which even could be adult children, you know? I mean, I'm, I'm 48 years old and I'm still somebody's child. Then your child is going to reap what you sow. I remember saying this, right? Is this something I said before? Did this police officer believe me? I guess you believe me now, huh, bro? I'm really sorry about your child because I don't ever... It's a shame that kids have to suffer the consequences of their parents' actions. I mean, my, my son had to at one point. You know, he doesn't anymore. I, I, I overly made up for that shit. Prostitute? I don't know. Somebody's child could have bitched 12, 12, could have been a prostitute or they didn't even know it or something. Yeah, premonition, foresight. Somebody predicted this. Knowing a prophet, they came for a fucking prophet, evil, five of swords, wanting to get revenge on a prophet. And this is what happened. Their child passed away. Yeah, is responsible for what? What are they responsible for? Maybe, maybe, I don't know. Is this, is this cop responsible? This cop could be responsible just for a lot of shit, man. Oh, a lot of this five of swords energy. I don't think it's just one thing. I think this cop is responsible for a lot of dirty shit that was going on around this whole situation here. Responsible for what? Responsible? How come you didn't win? Yeah. Responsible for a lot of a dark shit. A Pisces again. They didn't know what they were doing, right? Somebody didn't know what they were messing with, what they were doing. Responsible for a... Uh, these all these people this person's responsible for for what drinking under age letting things go partying yeah and holding on to money like this is the type of person where when they lock somebody up if they find money on you they pocket it this is the type of person where if they find drugs on you, they'll take it and resell it. That's what kind of cop this is. I can feel it. It's a dirty, dirty, dirty fucking cop. It couldn't have happened to a nicer guy. Now, for your child, I'm sorry. I will never say that. You know what I mean? 
I mean, unless you got your child involved to come after somebody as well, then I guess that was their decision, 12-12, and that is the shit that they that you reap what you sow. Somebody really thought they were above the law here. There's nobody above the law. And let me explain something to you. There's nobody above spiritual law. Nobody. I don't care who you are. I don't care if you're a judge, if you're a cop, if you're an investigator. I mean, because even the president is not above the law. Putin is not above the law. These gun motherfuckers are just actors. You really have, like, when the no fear thing has to become no fear. Very one-sided. They chose their side. The wrong side. So now what, spirit? Now what? Desperately wants to be you while despising you at the same time. Well, I don't know what to tell you about that. Opportunist. No talent. Not even in any way, shape, or form. Secretly watches you. So this police officer, as much as they can't stand whoever predicted this, right? As much as they can't stand it, they can't stop. This is part of their karma as well. Something going back to this person. So you network, whatever whatever this platform is that you got, TikTok, YouTube, Facebook, whatever it is, somebody's like, I can't stop watching this person. Tell me about this opportunist that secretly watches this person. Base chakra. They're watching you be stable, grounded. They could have been attacking this. You could have been feeling it in your spine, like a lot of etheric attachments. You could have felt this off down your spinal cord, maybe your lower back. That somebody was trying to fuck with your stability. They could have possibly been trying to put you on the street. One could mean something. Now they want to be on your side. Yeah, foundation. They were trying to mess with your home, your situation, your what you built. You Something that makes you feel like safe. These people that pick the side of the cop, they're next. Yeah, now this cop wants to be on the other side now. It's too late. I feel like that's the universe going. It's too late. You have to get your karma for what you did. And that's not even over. I'm sorry for the loss of your child, whoever this is for. But it doesn't just end there. Because I feel like this cop did a lot of dirty shit. This motherfucker thought that because he had a uniform on. Yeah, disaster. This person's life is going to be a disaster. And I feel like this person is responsible, like it said, for a lot of people's lives. Bringing disaster into a lot of people's lives. Is that true? Yeah. You brought chaos and disaster. Disaster and ceremony? What's that? Tell me about this disaster and ceremony. Regret something. They regret bringing this. They were, I don't know. Did they get involved in a ritual? Did this cop get involved in like a ritual or something? Yeah, they got themselves involved with some kind of... Um, I can't the true spirit. Is this like a, a blood ritual? A blood ritual. They regret it. So they were trying to destroy another person with spell work. Stay. Beep, beep. And now what? It's going. The disaster is going to stay. Like they're not going to be able to get out of it. Now they're, now they're going to try and get on your side so that you can stay somewhere. This, this is somebody who was trying desperately to get somebody thrown out on the street. And now what? Now they're going to try and like work for... Yeah, this is some, the justice system. Libra energy. But this is, this is just somebody who didn't think... Look, look. The justice... Nope. Not for me. I don't have to live by the laws that I'm, I'm enforcing. I just have to enforce them on other people. Because I'm the king of pentacles. Because I'm that motherfucker. No. No, this is somebody who thought, nope. The law, nope, not for me. Wow. Yeah. Not for me. 
this also the kind of person that possibly could have been married or this is why this person was never married or something like that This person is just all willy-nilly. I mean, I don't know. They could just be like in and out of relationships. Or they could be married. This person could be married. And they step out on, on, their, on their wife. Yeah. This is just that type of dude, man. This is that motherfucker. This is that, this is that cop. You know what I'm saying, you guys? Like, Divine Feminine, I know exactly. It's that cop. It's that dude where if you get pulled over with your boyfriend, Divine Feminine, and you're pretty, this is the kind of dude that fucking mocks and tries to embarrass your dude in front of you. You know what I mean? He's that dude. He was the dude in school who probably was the bully in school, and it never stopped. This couldn't have happened to a better person, Divine Feminine, and I feel like it happened. I keep saying Divine Feminine, though. They could have came for a Divine Masculine. But whatever it is, they picked the wrong one. Or the right one. Tell me why. Who, what is this? Yeah, this, this person was collaborating with what? This person was working together. Oh. I feel like this person drinks. They drink while they work. There's a greedy motherfucker too. Now these people, this per so this person was working together with all these people to do some greedy shit, and now what? And now and now now they want to offer something. Yeah, overall, overall this person's greedy, and they abused the authority they thought they had. Yeah, movements, choices, and decisions. Somebody likes to be the overall host. Thank you. This is the somebody. Look, look, look at only me. Listen to only me. This is a narcissistic cop. This is the worst fucking kind of cop. I'm, I'm picking up on an arrogant. That's why I'm getting like this arrogant. What you say this like like this. I don't like it. This is that motherfucker, man. This is like that dude in high school that was mean to geeks and stuff like that. They could have been connected to this. Depict. Represent, reproduce, or portray. They let two black cops in this white party. This person could be a black cop. I feel like it's a white cop, though. Yeah, it's a, it's a white cop. It's one of them, man. I can feel it. You're like the epitome. Yeah, they wanted to what? De survival? Depict? They want to portray what? Oh, survival. So it's almost like they want to act. It's just is like somebody who has that. Um, you know when they show those movies of those dudes who are like they come back from the war and they're never right. You know what I'm saying? Like click. Survival and click. This is somebody who clicks up. This clicky. And then there's someone else here who just like, I don't know, on, on, they're on their own. So this is somebody who rolls with the pack. Flattened your tires. This cop had something to do. They worked with somebody and offered somebody something to, to, to flatten another person's tires. Very nice. Very nice. That's exactly what cops are supposed... Yeah, acceptance. Because they desperately need to be accepted. So what you thought... What did you think? You thought that it would be cool to be a jerk-off? Because that's what I feel like. I feel like you're a fucking jerk-off, bro. I feel like... I don't know what your ding -ling looks like, but I feel like you have you have a lot of insecurities. You probably got beat by your father. You had daddy issues, probably mommy issues. This is somebody who really thought they played God, but they did it through... Is a leader. They wanted to portray. That's what they're saying. Is that what you're telling me? They wanted to portray, like it said, depict. Like they were a leader. Give me the true spirit. Is that what you're telling me? This is not what a leader does, bro. Let me tell you something with that climate shit. Uh, you may have a rough rest of the winter because with that foreclosure and all this other shit, you may wind up losing your home and being homeless, which is it feels like you were trying to do to somebody else. I'm done. I'm pissed off. 
Like, I'm getting agitated. And I, I feel like it could be this person where, like, you don't have the right to be pissed off. You know what I mean? This is the kind of person where they try to destroy someone else. And now the same shit that they did to someone else came back a widow. Widow in return. Is he responsible for somebody being a widow? So he has a murder under his belt. I command the truth, spirit. Is it just one? So something's coming back to you. Scheme. Uh, let me get something here. I can't stop this now. I feel like they want me to expose you. Fight back, y'all. I like it. She's checking. Yeah, somebody fought back with this person and they didn't like that. So they kept coming and coming and coming and coming at somebody. And it's just like now something's coming full circle for you, sir. And I use that. I use sir very lightly. Tell me about this with this widow and scheme. Is, is this person responsible for like offing people's husbands? M. What is this? How to handle a crazy dancing white boy. Yeah, it's a white boy. Tell me more. M-A. Somebody got a black boyfriend in college? I don't know. It could be secretly gay. Who knows? You never know these days. Just like we're in high school again, Karen. Yeah, this is like the uh, the Karen of men. That's what it's like. And they act like if they're in high school. M-A-L, what's this? This is somebody who always talks about um, football. Or it said that dude, man, entitled is an understatement. I don't like it. De denoting a jacket or a suit of a plain style with communist communist is that what you're telling me that this person's like a tyrant yeah I give me the truth you guys want me to look up urban dictionary this is a mean person this something is com this is amazing because this like lets me know that there's bad shit like people are getting Really bad karma, you guys, for coming for you. Brendan, that could mean something. A woman who is of immeasurable beauty and grace. They could literally be responsible for why someone that they were with, Truth, is... Is, it, is the husband's name Brendan? Let me find out something here. I feel like this person, if somebody named um, Brendan passed away, I commit a true spirit. Are they responsible for the for the passing of someone named Brendan, and then they left another person as a widow? Tell me about this, please. Tell me about this, please. Scorpio, Pisces, yeah, this person, tower moment, people are realizing that this Pisces, look, experience and judgment, uh, people are weighing out their options as to whether or not they even want to be around this person, yeah, Leo, for trying to, like, for ego, ego, fucking ego, the ego this dude has, man, tell me more, toxic love for money, out of narcissistic supply, this could also be LMAO, Property manager, landlord's wife. Is this even worth it? Did they have a... Um, hold on a second. So there's a there's a property manager or, or landlord's wife that came in the truth. Did they have an affair with this person? 
No, but they did some dirty work for this person. Tell me about near you. What's near you? Rough and near you? Trying to bring rough stuff near you or sending rough people near another person? Some kind of scheme? They're just telling me that somebody real rough is near me right now. Can they hear me? No. I came in the true spirit. Are they warning me? Are you warning me about something? Anyway, I just want to see what's up with this wife. Tell me about the wife. They were plotting with the wife. The a wife of a Leo. A Virgo. It could be a Virgo. The wife could definitely be a Virgo. They were they were doing this. Look, I'm just I can't. That this cop really just they they put their their they just got their shit dirty, their hands dirty. What is this? 31 minutes? What's up with that? Design Rough near you and kneel. So what what is their what is their rough near you? Petty cash looking a little too petty. Uh oh, somebody that works here? Somebody said you were crazy because of what you were exposing. So there's somebody near me right now. Are they dipping into petty cash? Looking a little rough, kneeling? Is somebody like withdrawing or something? Is somebody, I command the truth, is somebody dipping into petty cash here? No, it's not them. It's a female. Who's dipping into petty cash? Yeah, yes. This person's lost. They don't have anything. They possibly need drugs or something. What is this, man? They lost. They have no friends. Let me give me get a letter of this person and I'm gonna I'm gonna close this out. Give me a first a letter of someone's first name that's dipping in petty cash because they don't have any money. Tell me H H Is that like Haley or something? Their name begins with the letter H and they're dipping in petty cash. Yeah, I don't know. It could already be gone. They could be gone. I don't know. I'm closing this out. Um, it's it's here, man, you guys. So for those of you who just like, who are, are just like, I don't know where you're at with the part of your journey or with your exposing things or you think what's happening to you because there's a lot of you that are experiencing this gang stalking and, and even worse. You just stay, keep your head straight. Keep your mind straight and keep exposing. You don't need to post every fucking thing and changing your underwear and getting a shower and da 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 because, I mean, you know, you're, it, I think it's really odd though when some people have more videos than they do subscribers. But I mean, that is your choice to do what you want. But I'm just letting you know, like, I, I'm going to say what other people think. Nobody cares about fucking just what you're doing with your day to day shit. You know what I'm saying? Um, you're supposed to be really sitting to yourself, paying attention, allowing yourself to get messages. I see a lot of people exposing gang stalking, but it's like you're not awakened. You're like a, a, a you're still sleepwalking, and that's gonna fuck you up. 
You really need to start realizing and, and being aware of the messages around you. 3434, you're so focused on just making videos, 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 videos. Like, how, do you ever sit to yourself? Do you listen to music? Do you get messages? Because your spirit guides are talking to you and trying to warn you and help you through the situation. And, and it's like if you're just constantly just fucking wasting time making videos on shit that, I don't know. I don't know where this is coming from. I feel like I'm channeling somebody right now because I don't, I don't know why I'm saying this stuff. Is this a spirit guide or something saying this? Like, sit to yourself. We're trying to give you messages. Like, if you would just sit and be quiet. Go through the struggle. Not everything is happening to you. You're putting yourself, maybe you're putting yourself like you're overthinking things. Yeah, you're supposed to be putting a death to some things. You're supposed to be transforming. This is about death. You're supposed to be, you're, yeah. This is what these people want. Like, you, there could also be like, yeah, you're supposed to be like transforming and moving forward and like freeing your mind. Somebody's still stuck in a mental prison who's being gang stalked or something. You're supposed to stay to yourself. And I feel like that that somebody's like looking like a fool or something like that. Or it could be Scorpio or Aries. I don't know. I'm going to leave it at that. I love you guys. We're not going nowhere. Karma's real. Real rap. Love you.